All right, hikes with friends. Before we get hiking, these are my friends. This is Jared, who I met through this guy, Jaime. Right there, he's really tiny in the distance in the right corner, who I met through my bestie, Nikki. Right there. My outfit. Styling. Unfortunately, once again, I forget what the place was called. I think it was called Little Yosemite. I just remember one of the days we all went together. We were trying to look for Little Yosemite, and I'm not sure if this was actually it or not. But there are a few times when we're walking through, and it kind of does look like it. So I'm going to just say it was. Time I showed me some branch he picked up and smelled. It was smelled really good. Nikki and Jared taking pictures in the distance. I love the side of the hill. It was so great because, you know, like, you, you'll see in a second, all the rivers are just flooded because of, you know, being January and cold and... Did you hear that woodpecker? Ah, I love this too. This tree, how it's growing out there, but it was kind of scary. It looked fresh, so I wanted to walk by it pretty fast. <laughs> But yeah, uh, I love the green everywhere. It's January, so everything's all wet from the rainy season. And nice little bench to rest, but it's in a puddle, so we didn't rest there. And this was a cool little lookout spot. I had the worst boots on, but I had a change of shoes. So I was high me ha. So I got better grip, but because a few of these times, it's a little scary. And with the moss, it's a little slippery. So you don't want to mix scary and slippery because bad things happen this lookout was pretty amazing it's hard to capture on camera most of the time but it was pretty high up and over there was a little hill another little peak but we just stayed on this side I got a little scared right there because my friend grabbed me when I was videoing over the edge and I thought you know that kind of thing startles you so I thought he was gonna throw me off but he, he wasn't <laughs> I just got scared check this out it was cool it was a beautiful day the sun kept peeking through the clouds and making it bright making it dark making it rain making it all the weather types but there was this cool little waterfall part over here that I'm slowly but surely trying to get to And oh, there it is. The big old rock. It's nasty water. <laughs> and of course, somebody else being on top of it, I had to go on top of it too. Yeah, I'm gonna be surfing down this <laughs> rock. <laughs> You're like, I'm solid ground. Okay, wow. I don't know if you can really hear that but my friend said that he put a hammock between the two trees on the other side of the rock over there right above the waterfall <laughs> that would be so cool i think that would be so relaxing to hear and look at these falls they're just they're so dirty but man they're rushing pretty fast I don't know about you, but I could watch these all day, and I kind of have a lot of clips of just waterfalls, but, you know, that's what I'm here for. I'm here to capture it all. This tree was so, it was just looming over the edge, if it only knew. As you might notice, the audio goes up and down. Don't change your volume. Just keep it where it's at because all of a sudden it'll be low and you might want to turn it up. Then it will go high again and it will blast out your speakers. So just keep it where it's at. I have the volume under control. Don't worry about it. There's also a couple parts where there is absolutely no volume at all. And I would hate for you to try to turn it up. And then if you're wearing headphones or if you're in a room and then once the volume returns, it just blast you out and it's it's not good for the ears <laughs> it's not fun so just keep where it's at all right cool oh man this part right here always reminds me of Willy Wonka's chocolate factory the chocolate factory river <laughs> except for it's just dirty gross water 
on time lapse <laughs> that I would not eat or drink. And with that said, don't ask why I did this next part. Just don't. Let's just pretend like I didn't do that. But on one hand, it did leave like a cool mark on the screen, although I do wipe it away. It kind of makes it look a little dreamlike, like a little dream state. big stick here. I picked it up and I threw that thing. I threw it. Bang. Right down the river it goes. I thought it went under for a second. <laughs> Man, I love the way that rock looks across the way. It is so beautiful. There's the besties up there. Oh, and just in case you weren't seeing enough big waterfalls, here's a few little baby waterfalls. They were just coming out of the mountain from nowhere. It was just so cool to see. Look at water sliding down a rock into a little pond. Let's get in the pond. <laughs> I've always wanted to do that right there, that effect where you see under the water and above it at the same time. I think it's cool how it's dripping off the leaf right there too. After we start seeing this little river pick up and make more little waterfalls and drip drips, if you look up slowly into the background, you see the tree of life. That does it for today's video, guys. If you're still watching, give it a thumbs up, subscribe, do all the good things, leave your favorite part in the comments, and I will see you in the next one. Peace and love always.